one of the signs of spring can be seen in the stands and in the crack of a bat and the sounds of cheering. On the field, the thunder. Bug, left center. Girls playing softball harder than most boys play baseball. This is Coach Eaton, and these are his girls. The pitcher's Am Bam. This little one here is Frog. Nemo. That last one, Nemo, is quite possibly the MVP. We kind of spread out. I normally play uh, short center. Her real name, Emily Gregg, and her biggest challenge on the field isn't the other team, it's herself. And then it buckles. And no fault of her own, every game she straps on a modified heart guard. Instead of her heart, though, it protects a port near her shoulder that allows her to take new plasma once a week. Me and him's made an agreement. If she's running the bases, his players will not tag her at all. The reason being is that port, because if the port breaks, she will bleed that about two minutes, and ain't nothing I can do about it. As you know, I have a hypoplasmic and anemia. That, along with epilepsy, neurofibromatosis, Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, Brigada syndrome, supraventricular tachycardia, diseases hard to say, even harder to live through. We're proud of her. And, you know, she's proof that if you don't give up and you keep moving, that, you know, you can do whatever you set your mind to. Add selfless and caring to Emily's qualities. It's while she was at East Tennessee Children's Hospital that she noticed she could be doing something to help the other kids in there with her. Teddy I don't know what hit me. I just woke up one morning and I wanted to do a teddy bear's row. The bear is like a demonstration for our kids for like IVs, pecans, and ports, and I've had all three and had a demonstration bear. I thought if I had a, if I had a bear, then another kid should have a bear at their side too. At the ballpark, she's in the lineup. She's got more heart than anybody I know of. Hold the ball, hold the ball! Softball and a positive reminder on and off the field are saving Nemo. Don't give up. There's still some, there's still some peace in your life that just, just don't give up. In Rockwood, Tennessee, Marco Villarreal, Local 8 News.